Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel for another video today. Um, today we are at Costco. I don't know if you can see it back there, probably not. Um, and we're gonna do some Christmas shopping because I just have Finley, the others are in school. She ain't gonna remember anything I show her. Um, and I haven't been to Costco, it's been over a month, so. I was, you know, having Costco withdrawals. So we're going to go to Costco, see what they have out for Christmas. I'm going to buy some Christmas presents. I will haul it all for you guys. You know, I always do. And I might hit up Sam's Club as well because I am in um, a town that has a Sam's Club and a Costco. So we'll see. Maybe we'll do both today. Oh, there's your cup. Okay. Let's get going to Costco and see what they have out for Christmas 2021. Costco. Yeah. You ready to go? Okay, kiss. <gasps> okay guys right when you walked in costco they had all of like the kitchen stuff set up so they had this three-piece thermometer set for $21.99 an immersion blender um a cuisine art is that how you say that blender for $27.99 and then this bigger one was $149.99 i think cuisine art must have like paid them to put all their stuff at the front because most of it was that brand and then they did have this newer keurig k supreme plus and that one was 134.99 the guy was setting these beautiful poinsettias up and he said they were 14.99 but they didn't have a tag on them yet and then how pretty are these winter garden boxes i was afraid that i wouldn't keep it alive so i didn't buy it but they are gorgeous these LED glass light trees. I'm assuming these are really tall because um, they were $75 and that's a good, a good bit. But they just had all types of different ornaments and stuff like that. And then I saw these waxed amaryllis plants. I saw some of these at Sam's Club as well. So that must be like a thing. And then guys, this deer and tree set, I was so close to buying. I think they were $49, $46.99. Um, you'll see in a minute that I actually pick them up like I am full-on considering purchasing these um, But I just have so much Christmas decor already that I passed on them. But how gorgeous are these? Moving on to toys um, They had this guitar set up for hundred and seventy nine dollars And then they just had a lot of stuff to offer. They didn't have as much as Sam's I would say um, But they had some more unique stuff for sure, like this Harry Potter set of all the Barbie dolls for $49.99. I had never seen that before. And then this um, craft, this paint your own unicorn thing, they actually had the unicorns for girls. And then they do have a dinosaur one for boys, which I thought was really cool. So if you have a younger child, definitely something to consider for them. Both of my girls love, love, love wet brushes. Like they're the only ones they want me to use on them. And I found these little sets that have like a big one, a little one and several hair bands. I picked out the Minnie Mouse one for Kylie and I'm sorry, for Finley. And then I actually grabbed Kylie Ariel just cause I don't know, I was looking at them. I think she would have loved any of them. And that's the one that I ended up grabbing, but those were 12 99. So that'll be a nice little stocking stuffer. This was like a Hoover star, I think that's what it's called. I just thought it was cool, you know? This is a karaoke stand. How cool is this? It comes with like the two speakers on the side there. This was $174, which I thought was really cool. Like if you had a basement, teenager, you know, just awesome times down there hanging out with friends, I think. But I'm not there yet, maybe in a couple of years. I really liked this Costco puzzle, but I knew that we wouldn't actually do it, so I didn't buy it, but I do think it's a cool idea. These I thought were cool, so they were like um, helping reading for $15.99, these big sets, and they had them for preschoolers, kindergarten, early readers, all of that stuff. This jewelry box, I will show it to you more when I do the actual haul part, but I do buy it and it was the last one and I was so excited that I found it because if you remember from my last Costco haul, Kylie really wanted it and that was literally the last one like it was just meant to be. They had this gorgeous Christmas wreath, but it was $45.99, just not worth the price I didn't feel like. 
And then I'm just gonna kind of show you a lot of the tech stuff that they have. Um, they really had a lot of that sort of thing. So this Orbi is like a home security system. Um, and then they have like all these different cards, like bundles, so this one's a GoPro, um, you know, the Oculus glasses, stuff like that. Just, you would grab a card and take it to the front, but they had a lot of that stuff on sale as well. And then this was a folding electric bike, which I just thought was interesting. Um, like, why do you need an electric bike? Can't you just like ride a bike? I don't know, that was $340. I just thought that was a little intense for a bike that you're supposed to ride anyway like i don't know somebody tell me why do we need electric bikes you're supposed to be exercising when you ride a bike anyway this was a sheepskin rug and i think it was real like real sheepskin so i don't know i'm not really about that but it was really soft but you know however they do have a great array of throw blankets which I am a huge fan of and Chris would probably kill me if I bought another blanket because he says I have way too many of them and then moving on to like holiday snacks um like chocolates you know they had the whole aisle set up with all the chocolates wrapped all pretty for Christmas like these Kirkland ones here um you know just all the chocolate boxes trying to get us to eat nine million calories for the entire season every single day I did like these little Kirkland ones that were individually wrapped, but I passed on them, but the, I thought it was a good idea. Guys, this, I don't even like tea. I don't drink tea, but look at this container. I almost bought this just for the container. Like you could use that for so many things, like just in your kitchen counter. I loved it so much. Okay, so we're done at Costco and we're actually at Sam's Club now, which I think I'm gonna turn into a whole nother video because I got so much footage from Costco and I the hall's pretty big and it's just too much to put in one video. So we're gonna go to Sam's Club. I'm gonna pause this video here. Um, when I get home, I will show you the Costco haul and ooh, it's a lot. I got a lot of good stuff. There's a little peek back there and all the stuff I got and I'm hoping to get some good stuff at Sam's Club too. So be sure to stick around for that video. So let's Okay guys, so I'm back from Costco now. I have everything laid out behind me and I'm so excited to show all of it to you guys. Um, I got a lot of presents for both girls at, at Costco, Sam's Club. I'm all mixed up, went to both places today. Um, so, I'm excited to show all of what I got to you. I also know that I, I've already showed you like all of the toys that they had to offer. Um, this Pirates Booty was from the Sam's Club haul. Again, I don't know which one you've seen already. So <laughs> forgive me if you've already seen that. But anyway, I'm gonna turn you around, show you what we got at Costco. I spent more at Costco than I did at Sam's. So I think I spent like 260 or 270 at Sam's Club and the Costco total was around, it was like 360, 350, 360. So, but again, I got a lot of presents. So let me just stop chitty chatting and show you what we got. So God, this is a dog bed, obviously. This is the Brentwood original faux fur pet mat. Um, guys, this thing is so soft. Like, can you tell just by me rubbing it how soft it is? I think that the dogs are just going to love this. Finley and Piper are back here doing something, but um, I can't wait to lay this down for them. This was $32. They needed a new pet bed for sure. Their old one was just like from Aldi and it was like 15 bucks. So this one is actually big enough. Thanks, Finley. So this one is actually big enough for both of them to lay on. So that should work well. So we went ahead and got that. That's like part of their Christmas, but I'm gonna give it to them now. I got two things of bread. One is just the original country white for us. And then the rosemary Parmesan is for my mom. These are, I believe they're $6.99. They're $5.99 a piece for two loaves of bread. So that is not bad. I'm gonna move this so that I can show you this thing. So this is the simple trendy modern touch, a um, hundred piece, or it says create a hundred plus accessory jewelry kit. Um, so it has like all the different letter beads and different shapes and oh my gosh, so many different things. I think there's fabric, like you can make these types of bracelets in there as well. Um, it comes with a nice little like box. 
So it has 2,900 round faceted beads, 210 alphabet beads. I mean, just look at that list. 23 skeins of friendship thread, three skeins of nylon cording, 10 pearl adhesive beads, like just so many things. Um, four hair clips, good Lord, we can make all kinds of stuff. So she actually saw this when we were in Costco another time recently and said she wanted it. So I grabbed this for her. It was like 20, $21.99, I believe. I don't know, I'll have to um, look back in the video. I'm pretty sure I showed the price tag of this though when I was buying it. Um, and then for Finley, I grabbed this wooden dress up dolls, a hundred piece play set. This was $19.99, I believe. And it says there has a storage tin that doubles as a play scene. So I just think she will love this. I'll have to monitor her with it because I think there are some smaller pieces, but, um, you know, I think she's going to love that. I got, <laughs> look at Piper already like, oh my gosh, is this for me? Piper, is that for you? It's so soft, isn't it? Oh my God, she wants it. <laughs> that is the, no, like, Piper, stop. Mm -mm, not right now. You can have this in a minute, okay? Um, well, that's nice. I guess she likes it. So I grabbed a two pack of the muffins. These were, I think they're $7.99 for two. Uh, where's the price? Something like that. I'm pretty sure they're $7.99 for two packs of them. I grabbed a thing of cookies. Now, let me tell you all this cookie story. So when we were loading stuff into the car, Finley was trying to help, and so she picked them up, threw them at me, and they went everywhere. So there were a couple of, tra of losses here. I think we lost like four or five cookies on the ground in Costco that I just couldn't, or like in the parking lot that I just couldn't recover. I did get the ones that like just fell in my car, but yeah, we lost a few cookies, but that's probably for the better. Anyways, we grabbed a thing of the organic spring mix. We're gonna have some salads, some chicken salads tonight for dinner, so that's what that is for. You guys know that we love the Sam's Club um, Peppermint Bark. We talked about it last time. This one, though, this is a Kirkland one. Why doesn't it say? My goodness. Okay, so this Peppermint Bark says that it's made with... It said that it was made with, like, Dutch chocolate or something. That's what the sign said. It doesn't say it anywhere on here, though. But it does look really good. So I went ahead and bought this. This was about the same price. It was $12.99 as it is when you get it at Sam's Club. I grabbed a few things of fruit because we just needed it. I grabbed a thing of organic blueberries, some far, farms, some farms, <laughs> some green grapes, and then a thing of strawberries just to finish out the week because my kids have been going through fruit like crazy. These are a few more Christmas presents back here. Well, actually, we have a lot more Christmas presents, but um, I bought each girl a set of these five-minute storybooks. So... Fin or not Finley, Kylie is getting the five minute princess books. These were $20 and 99 cents a piece. And there is two, four, six, eight, 10, 12 stories. Does it say that on the front? It really does. Okay. So there's 12 storybooks in here. Um, she is getting really good at reading. And so I think she will enjoy these. And then I got, um, Finley, the five minute Mickey mouse, like the Mickey mouse clubhouse ones, which I think she'll love. And then I got each girl a um, wet brush. So Finley gets Minnie Mouse. These were $12.99. So there's a mini brush and a big brush. And then Kylie gets the Little Mermaid. So again, these are $12.99. Little brush, big brush, and then some hair ties. And there were hair ties on um, Finley's one as well. And then Bryson, literally the only present I bought him at all today is this Dude Perfect book. And it was $18.79. We're buying him a basketball goal and a few other things. And so I don't want, um, like, I want to be able to get him everything that he is asking for. So I didn't get him. Chris. So I didn't get him anything else but this. Um, and then Kylie is so into crafting. You guys know that if you've been following me for a while. So I got her this paint your own unicorn sweet shop. It has like several different six ceramics, five sweet scents and 24 paint colors for her to, um, you know, craft with. So I picked this up for her. I showed you guys some dinosaur ones as well. They had like boy and girl ones, which I thought was nice. And then the last thing that I got at Sam's Club was the biggest purchase, or Costco, I'm sorry. The biggest purchase is this American Girl doll. So this is one of the Welly Wishers, which is like a smaller doll. Um, and I picked her Kendall. Now she is actually going to the American Girl doll store this, this Saturday, or next, yeah, the 20th. 
of November because it's her birthday and she's going to pick out like a big American Girl doll. And so I figured this would be a good Christmas gift um, to go with her big one. She'll have a little one. So this is the garden classroom set. So it has all of these like garden classroom toys. Um, and I think she's going to love this. This was $90, like $89.99 at Costco. And yeah, like I said, I picked Kendall and my dogs are fighting now. So that's great. But that is everything that I got at Costco. Like I said, I spent about $350. I hope that you guys enjoyed both this Sam's Club and the Costco haul. If you did, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.